Hello there my friends, welcome to part 30 of my Monsanto World full playthrough on the PlayStation 5 and hope you guys are doing well. Now this is after Sharish Valder and Runa no Kagante, so uh, please check out that episode man, that was um, that was awesome. I really enjoyed the ending to Iceworm. Uh, the only thing is I wish they fleshed out the story a little bit more because it was so interesting. Um, you know, that whole thing with Sharish Valder, it was such a mystery. I, I thought it was awesome, guys. I really enjoyed it. Uh, it was a little bit sad as well because I didn't actually want the story to kind of end. <laughs> but anyway, guys, like I said in the last episode, the real game actually begins. It's crazy. We're going to meet some brand new monsters. You know, if you're new to Monsanto World and Ice World in general, there's going to be a ton of other monsters. So uh, what we need to actually do, we're not really going to get into any fights. I will do an optional quest, but you see in the top right hand corner where it says speak to the field team leader and head out. It says follow Runa Nagante. Guys, I'm just going to tell you straight. It's not really a spoiler, but I'll tell you straight. We're not going to actually be able to fight uh, Runa Nagante until oh my god i think it's uh master rank 100 so as you can see there i'm a master rank 23 on the way to 100 we're going to unlock something called the guiding lands which we're actually going to do right now and we're going to unlock other monsters as well so it's going to be quite exciting a little bit scary because some of these monsters are quite frightening um by the way if you check my defense i've upgraded all the armor pieces that I have as well. There's other upgrades to do. But in the meantime, what I've got on at the moment is 855 defense. And that's quite massive. And again, that's going to increase later on as well. So anyway, so that's what we're going to do now, guys. We're going to speak to the field team leader and head out. And we'll probably finish up on an optional quest. So a little bit slightly shorter uh, video than normal. But anyway... All right, let's speak to... Oh, actually, I need to check one more thing. Oh, for crying out loud. I'm waiting for a key ingredient to be ready. Um, you know, a flourishing key ingredient. Then I can actually go and get it. But, um, guys, every time I log on, even when I'm farming, it never comes up. But anyway, don't worry about it. We'll worry about it when the time comes. All right, let's speak to this dude. Yo. Yo. <laughs> you look well rested. Did you enjoy yourself last night? Of course I did. Got drunk. What more do you want? <laughs> We've got a lead on Nagagante's whereabouts. Field teams found tracks in the Elder's Recess. It's a sl solid match. Guess who went there after feasting on the old Everworm's energy? Mm -hmm. It's likely still there now. Let's find it before it takes off after its next meal. Be quick. Uh, but don't be hasty. We know what this thing's capable of. Be sure you're well prepared. I'll wait here until you're ready. Yeah, guys, there's nothing to prepare for. Don't worry about it. We're just going to speak to him again. Ready. So, you're ready to set off for the Elder's Recess to find No Gigante? Yes. All right, let's do it, guys. Let's go. We'll follow that thing to the ends of the new world.
It's amazing! Is insane, guys. <laughs> gotcha. They did such a great job with the cutscenes in this expansion. It's just mind blowing, guys, honestly. handler <laughs> all right look i don't know if it's going to pull up a tutorial um etc but guys look here's what what this is this is called the guiding lands it's an unknown locale i won't spoil it yet but the law behind this place is incredible when the time comes i'll explain it i'm only talking to new players so don't worry if you're a veteran you don't need to know all this <laughs> All right, but listen, this place is, in my opinion, it's very un, it's a very unpopular opinion, but I love it here. I actually enjoy being in the Guiding Lands. But um, anyway, look, you're going to have uh, four, no, one, two, three, uh, I think six different biomes. One's going to be, as you can see, very similar to the Ancient Forest. There's one going to be like the Wild Spire Waste. Uh, you just heard the Handler. There's one similar to, no, it is the same as the Coral Highlands. Elder's Recess. The Hall of Frost Reach, etc. So you get the gist. Oh, check this out. Hey, partner! I right. think we could build right. camp here. Okay. All right, down below is going to be the Elder's Recess thing. We can't uh, go there yet. We have to unlock here in a few more episodes. We'll definitely get that unlocked. But anyway, let's just follow the handler. Like I said, all we're doing is just unlocking the place. That's all. Right, check it out. Where are we now? Hey, partner. This should, yeah, this should be the Coral Highlands bit. I may as well read this. This uh, this is insane. How can there be two regions coexist? I, I didn't read that properly. I think the rule we heard came from over here. So yeah, just follow the handler. Don't worry about it too much. Trust me, guys. Proceed with caution. Oh shit! <laughs> what was that? I don't remember that. Oh, I do remember it. I know what it is, guys. Story. Okay, going... Oh, right, guys, I'll shut up. <laughs> Look, check it out. Uh, Palico up there. Rathalos decayed carcass, where? Okay, very quickly, if you look up there... Oh, I may as well go up here real quick. Okay, again, we need to unlock it. It's not available now, but through this area here... That will unlock later in the story. That will be like the Hoarfrost Reach. And by being in this um, guiding lands, we're going to be able to pick up unique materials. And we can now start augmenting our equipment. It's awesome. I enjoy it, guys. So that that's me. You're getting hungry, Jesus Christ. 
Okay, we've got a camp. Time to start doing some research. Oh, by the way, about those tracks you found, they contain an odd type of secretion. I've never seen this in a New Wilds or the Hinterlands. It may be unique to this region. And then there's whatever's making that roaring sound. Be careful out there, okay? Hey, partner. I haven't even eaten. Uh, guys, we're not really going again to a fight, so don't worry. Okay, look, I'm going to show you around a little bit, and then we, you know, where um, find the source of the roar. We'll go there soon, but I'll just show you around. It's just a basic tour, <laughs> basically. All right, so let's go down here. So we're still in like an ancient foresty type area, Diablos. So going up that way is going to be the wild spire. Uh, area. In fact, let's drop down this way first and check it out. <laughs> Look at the effluvium. Seem familiar? Well, this is a rotten veil vale, um, area. What's that again? What's this yellow thing? Oh, oh yeah, I remember that. Okay. Anyway, uh, so let's just keep uh, moving and we'll go down this way. So there's no monsters or anything, not yet. And like I said, guys, we're going to be back here. Don't worry. A majority of our time is actually going to be here. <laughs> Another Palico just chilling out here. Oh, shit, there's Gyros here. I didn't, <laughs> I didn't even know. No, leave me alone. I'm not here to fight me. So there's a Palico... All right, so we can go up here, grab that, why not? All right, should be some uh, bugs, I think. Huh? Oh, yeah, this... Okay, this is starting the Ancient Forest parts as well. There we go. This is what I was looking for. <laughs> Remember, it's been three years, guys. I've not been here for three years, so a little bit rusty. All right, well, all right, I'll tell you what, let's just go and get this done. Okay, so look, in the next episode, I'm going to start um, exploring and venturing out. But in the meantime, it's just a very quick overview of what this place is about. I wonder, can I circumvent this cutscene? Yeah, we can. All right, check it out. So this is a wild spy region. <laughs> it's pretty cool, guys. I really like it. It's, it's awesome, man. <laughs> That's amazing. So you've just basically got all biomes all available in one area. So anyway, you get the gist. Um, but let's go and see this cutscene thing. So find the source of the raw in the forest region. And by completing this, we can now access Master Rank 6 quests. Where is it? Where's Footbrid? Oh. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> this dude is a badass. so sick guys yeah Dora we're not gonna get into a fight they're, they're gonna leave <laughs> oh crap he's never hit me before he's gonna leave now all right there you go so all the monsters have left so all this is is just to unlock the place and how do we unlock Zenoga? Hey, all right, there don't seem to be any monsters around. We should head back to base. Okay, that's what we're going to do. So, anyway, let's return back to Saliana. <laughs> Look at those casts on. It looks so confused. All right. Okay. To the land of discoveries, reach the guiding lands, blah, blah, blah. Okay, I'll see you back at Saliana. Great. All right, guys, we are back. Okay, field team leader. Wow, that's some story. Who would have thought a place like that existed? Uh -huh. <laughs> uh -huh. I know. Arathalos was fighting a Diablos, and then a Zenoga joined in. Really? While we were testing how high we could go with the airship, I remember seeing a strange mountain like shape on the horizon. The third fleet wanted to conduct an investigation into it since they had no solid evidence of anything like that existing. But it looks like you guys managed to beat them to the punch. Mm -hmm. From what I'm hearing, the land contains regions that resemble the locales we, we're already active in. Okay. There's got to be something fundamentally different about them though. You'll need to focus on gathering samples from bones and ore so that we can compare them to data we already have. Understood. Understood. We'll get started right away. Yeah. Was there anything else you noticed that was off? Uh-huh. Uh-huh. <laughs> Actually, we found tracks that had a strange composition to them. I never saw anything like them in the New World or the Hinterlands. They're definitely from a monster, but I couldn't pinpoint what monster made them. Um... I think I'll have the time to look into those tracks too, if you want. Who knows, if we can analyze those tracks, they might lead us to something big. Groundbreaking, even. Roger. Understood. I'll leave that, leave that to you then. Now that's sorted out, the most difficult part is next. What the heck do we call that place? Let's see. I think I got it. Since you were led there by Nogigante, the guiding lands has a nice ring to it. <laughs> All right, let's get to cracking the mystery of the guiding lands. Let's do this. You ought to look into that Zenoga first. Oh, and don't forget to collect samples from bones and ores while you're out there. All right. All right. You heard the lady. Head out to the guiding lands when you're ready. Oh crap. <laughs> <laughs> all right guys um all right let's read this okay go on an expedition in the guiding lands the guiding lands is a complex ecosystem consisting of multiple regions that affect each other go on an e expeditions in the guiding lands to find out more about the monsters and characteristics of each region only master rank is available in the guiding lands You'll receive, a master, you'll receive master rank points for any large monster you hunt in the guiding lands, even on expeditions. Large monsters will escape and be replaced by other large monsters after a while. But if you're fighting them or if they're low on health, they will stay around longer. If you faint while on exhibition, the uh, uh, exhibition. <laughs> if you faint while on an expedition in the guiding lands, you will receive fewer rewards when hunting a large monster. Right, so 
so these are region levels but anyway the more you research large monsters in each region the more the region level will increase at higher region levels new powerful species and tempered monsters may start appearing the large monsters in the guiding lands will drop rare items and yield special materials if you carve or capture them so make sure to take them to the smithy one word of warning as one region's level increases and changes, the level for another region may go down. Okay, uh, gathering materials in the Guiding Lands. In the Guiding Lands, mining out crops and bone piles will also produce special materials that can't be obtained and elsewhere. You'll also be able to find gathering points that yield increasingly valuable materials the more you use them. Each region has its own unique materials, so make sure you try at every gathering point you come across. If you, if you keep going at it, you may even run into special gathering points. Guys, that was a lot. It's a big info dump, a lot of information. Uh, I'm only, again, speaking to people who are new to this. Um, honestly, all of this, don't worry about it too much. It will make sense the more you, you actually um, have experience. I'm on MR49 already. Okay. Guys, we're halfway there, which is great. That's that's excellent. So hey, now partner. that's happened, hit a part when investigators would you like to take on next? Right, guys, I'm not gonna do that today because honestly, we could be hours and hours in the guiding lands, right? So I wanna start afresh there. I'm gonna show you show you around, show you how it works, etc. But we're not gonna do it in this episode, otherwise, this will be like a two and a half hour video. So what I'm going to do is, um, anyway, that's the intro into the Guiding Lands, and we are going to go there. But what I want to do is, <laughs> Mr. Piggy, oink, oink. Okay, but what I want to do is, guys, I want to upgrade my Rock Steady Mantle. I think that's going to be quite important. I need it for the Guiding Lands anyway. So we're going to have to fight... Oh, my God. <laughs> Christ's sakes. Okay. Uh, let me just take a breath. It's so exhausting reading, guys. Investigating the Guiding Lands alone or as a leader. The Guiding Lands has been added to the quest boards and world map. Point the cursor to the Guiding Lands and go on an expedition. You can also go on expeditions via the quest boards. Press L2 or R2 to check info for each region and see which monsters are currently there. When going on an expedition in the Guiding Lands, you can select with your own objective when you depart. This will help other players with the same objective to find and join you more easily. You can also change the objective by talking to the handler. Okay, join other players to advance your own. Uh, look, all this is, is is for multiplayer. As you know, I'm a strictly solo player. I work alone. So this won't really apply to me. But if you want to read this, guys, I'll leave this here for a few seconds. You can pause it and read it. But yeah, Guiding Lands is a lot of fun, though. I really do enjoy uh, being there. But anyway, so let's uh, let go of that. And let me just go into this. <laughs> You're kidding. Please, I'm not reading this. Guys, I'm not going to do Call of Tarath. I've already explained that when we were in the base game. Um, so I'm not actually doing this. But again, if you want to read this, you can read it. All right, I'll move on to the next page. So pause it, etc. Uh, by the way, it's an awesome fight. Don't get me wrong. It is, but I'm just choosing not to do it. It's going to take days, weeks, or months. <laughs> don't have, I don't have that sort of time, you know? All right, please, game. Just let me get into the freaking... All right, good. <laughs> good. All right, so this is... No, not that one. Jesus. Right, this one is a tempered freaking Black Diablos. All right, quest is called Piercing Black. It'll reward us with 34,000. 560 zenny and this will upgrade the rock steady mantle so this is what we're going to do and there was something i was going to show you as well all right guys you remember i told you that there is a <coughs> excuse me an event an event we can do i mean there's loads there's loads of events but there's one particular one i want to do and i'm going to farm it to death is it this one no not that one all right give me a moment guys i don't remember what it's called so i have to look for it Oh my god, are you kidding? No, it's not that. What? Oh, this one, this one. Right. Okay, we're kind of midway through the game until we reach the end game bosses like Fatalis, Alatrion, etc. 
if you want amazing decos god tier decos it's still rng and you're gonna have to repeatedly do it but it's this fight here it's called the wrath of thunder descends it's a Zenoga, a tempered Zenoga. He's quite mean, very nasty, <laughs> and it's in the ancient forest. And as beautiful as the ancient forest is, it's a nightmare to fight him. But anyway, this is what you want to be doing constantly if you want to get those amazing decos. Another one, uh, which is, in my opinion is actually better, but we're not going to unlock it until Master Rank 100. It's going to be these ones here. So, so not, not that, sorry, this one here, uh, Kushala. Uh, Tiostra, Lunastra, and Namiel. Uh, oh no, not that one. No, no, these three. But I like to do the Tiostra one, guys, because I find it a bit easier out of all of them. Lunastra is a pile of shit, and Kushal is a pile of shit, so I'm not going to hunt them. But if you repeatedly do Day of Ruin, you'll get all of the best, the best um, decos. So, uh, yeah, anyway, so just letting you know, letting you know. All right, guys, I'll meet you over there. So I'll select the quest. I'll eat, get prepped, etc., etc., and I'll see you back there. Hey, guys. Shit! <laughs> get out of here quick! <laughs> God damn it, man. Obviously, I don't want to fight you with my Mushroom Answer set. Bloody hell, game. Oh, we've got Gachalakas, guys. Okay, let's grab one of those little guys. There's also Gadgelaka traps as well. All right. Um, okay, this is the first monster I'm going to fight where I've got God 5. So I wonder how this is going to feel against um, a monster like that. Basically, I'm using the same build as I did for Shara Shivalda because obviously Diablos is weak to uh, ice. So we'll see how this, um, how this goes. But to be honest, guys, in my opinion, don't really need... Um, guard five for most of these monsters i think uh well i mean my experience anyway i find a uh, guard three to be more than sufficient you know get scout nuts actually we may as well go up there all right guys so this is gonna be a little scary because it is a black diablos and it's tempered so but hey i've upgraded my weapon i've upgraded my armor so we should be in a good position i hope <laughs> i hope all right. Okay, we're ready. Let's get suited up and... Right, there we go. Shara. Okay, and I want to change this to Screamer Pods. All right, there we go. Done. I'm really excited, guys. I mean, look, we're, we're now finished the main story. We've actually got um, <laughs> a lot of new monsters to face, honestly. So I'm really excited about it. It's going to be awesome. All right, so Temporal Mantle first. Okay, she's going to be walking about there. Let's shoot the floor. <laughs> she's massive, guys. No, no, no. Okay, here, here. Nice. Okay. Oh my god, it's so far. Why does it fling me so far away? Jesus. Jesus, I got nudged by the tail, guys. Nice. Okay, already. Come on, come on. <laughs> oh my god. Kiro came in clutch for me, guys. Oh, damn it. Oh, I still got it. I still got it. It's fine. Hey, why did my counter come out? Piece of shit. I've right, got the horn. Okay, I don't want to be there. I need to sharpen again. Well, I don't have to, but I like to be... Hey, hey, hey! Oh, God damn it. Okay, guard five. Jesus, I didn't even feel it. That's amazing. Hey! Nice! 
<laughs> okay. I swear I'm taking my counters as normal, but... Alright. Uh, guys, I don't want to speak too soon, but we are absolutely destroying her. You okay, Black Diablos? You seem a bit sad. Oh, crap. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Okay, I'm going to stop being cocky, guys. Whoa. Kuro, need a heal, please. Oh, God damn it. Thank you, Kuro. Thank you, buddy. Oh my god. <laughs> guys. Oh, come on, guys. That's not fair. That is not fair. Alright, alright. Okay, let's switch to that so I can get full critical boost. Okay. Alright, back in it. Actually, not quite. Let me sharpen. Okay. Is she gonna dig? Yeah, she is. She is. Oh, okay. Well, that was that was close, guys. That was close. Not gonna lie. Come on, come on. Shit! Shit! Damn it, guys! I was too slow. Guys, the damage is insane. Okay. Okay, a few hits and okay guys oh hey oh god hey when she does that all right um okay i need to be more careful i'm making too many mistakes uh one of them was bullshit though that wasn't my fault <laughs> that was not my fault um but anyway all right we can do this And like I said, the reason I am doing this is so that I can prepare myself for uh, Guiding Lands. Uh, trust me, you're going to be there for a long time, guys. Okay, what can I do here? Too late. Damn it. Alright, she's not enraged. Oh, for crying out loud, man. Where, oh, I don't want to be up here. <laughs> Jesus. All right. So I'm going to be on the head. Uh, she's in rage? What? Why? Okay. Let me switch the screamer then. If she's angry or pissed off, it's no point. Don't want to do that, man. Okay, good. Good. Lord the wing. Oh, Jesus. damage though that's pretty sick damn it i'm gonna lose some uh five percent from my critical boost shit my bad that was my fault my fault oh crap <laughs> better heal guys no leave me alone <laughs> she knows i was low on health <laughs> no not that this oh damn it oh my god I was way too close. No, no, not that. What are you doing? Jesus, Emma. Christ's sakes. Oh, stop it. God, that's so frustrating, guys. I don't 
don't like how close that is. <laughs> I think she's nearly ready. Uh, kind of. Oh, crap. No. Oh. Okay, guys. My conclusion is Guard 5 is amazing, but it's not necessary. Maybe, maybe against, obviously, um, uh, other enemies, but not... Wait. Oh, shut up. <laughs> oh, no. Not this again. Stop it. Oh crap. Oh god. Okay. Um, I don't know. Is she ready? Is she nearly ready? I'm looking at the uh, mini map. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Okay, okay, okay. What's she doing though? <laughs> wow. All right. All right. Oh, come on. Where are you, man? Okay. <laughs> She's right next to Angela. Okay, fine. Um, so we'll teleport there. Is there anything? Materials? Anything? No. All right, guys. Let's just uh, teleport there, I guess. All right, we're going to jump in the tent real quick because that'll give us a free sharpen. And uh, there we go. Oh, damn it. No, 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 no. I need... Wait, one sec. One sec. One sec. Where the hell is it? Okay, that's what I needed. Screamer pods. Okie dokie. So we're back on this. No, not Anjanath. Damn it, guys. They're both together. Um, possibly they're going to have a turf war, I hope. But there's also a trap there. Anyway, let's see what happens. Oh, crap. <laughs> Wait, where's Angela? Uh, what? What the hell is going on? the hell guys <laughs> all right anyway okay let's do that i hope i don't kill her by accident all right i tell you what i've got an idea i've got an idea we're gonna jump back down okay she's in rage that's good we're gonna wait here and i got you like a trap should get her okay all right just wait here Okay, I'm not going to do anything. Well, maybe one hit. <laughs> okay, let's just leave it there. If I'm correct in assuming she's close to being captured, after this is done, she's going to start limping. But let's block just in case. <laughs> oh. Maybe not. Guys, I was so sure she was going to be ready. I didn't want a leg, man. God damn it. Guys, I love the lance. It's so good. <laughs> I don't want to do that, man. Okay, I don't want to kill her. I'd rather not, but... Okay, check it out. I mean, surely, come on. Surely this is going to do it. This will finish her off. Oh, poor Diablos. She, she actually lifted him off. <laughs> All right, let's see what happens. 
If she starts limping. Come on. Uh, what's happening? She's limping. We're good. <laughs> that was a good fight, Loudness. Well done, man. All right, guys. We'll, I'll see you over there. We'll just go and capture her. Hey guys okay check it out i think she's not ah she's not gone to her thing her lair <laughs> jesus christ she's about to leave oh god i really hate that guys anyway she was huge as well my god Anyway, it's all over. <laughs> so this will upgrade our rock steady. And like I said, guys, next episode, we're going to be exploring guiding lands. And I'll, I hope we can actually fight Zanoga as well. And what I'm planning to do is once we fight Zanoga, I'll show you the event uh, where we fight the tempered one as well. Anyway, let's grab all of that. Oh, what's that? Okay, not hungerless. What's this? Oh, for Christ's sakes, guys. <laughs> Slider. I All I ever get is sliders. Jesus. All right, nice. It's been upgraded. I'll see you back at Celiana, guys. Hey, guys. Okay, we are back. Right, check this out. The Admiral's got something. Oh my god, I don't believe this. I know what this is. I didn't realize it would be so soon. I thought it was going to be in a... Well, well, when I level up a little bit more. But, um... Okay, let's talk to him. We're not going to do it now. But I think we're going to do it in the next episode. So it's kind of changed my plans a little bit. But let's see how it plays out, guys. Hey, kid. Been waiting for you. We got things to discuss. Okay, check it out. You heard the rumors of Shatterhorn, right? Seems a few hunters exploring the Horfrost Reach caught a glimpse of something. Something like a Kirin with its horn broken off. <laughs> I know, right? A real ear perker. So, I figured I'd go out to the Reach and take a look for myself. Mm, I looked high and low, but no sign of any Kirin, much less a hornless one. But I did find tracks. Fresh tracks. It's strange, though, having a Kirin show up all of a sudden out here. Which means it came from somewhere else. So, we gotta go and find the Shattered Horn. I already filed a quest with your handler. Who knows where it came from, what's up with its horn. But it's our job to put the pieces together. Now get moving, and don't keep me waiting. Oh man, guys, I wasn't expecting this yet. Um, I've really got to think about this. Okay, look, we're gonna unlock a monster. Forget the Kieran. <laughs> the Kieran's actually the starters. The other monster is gonna be the main course, <laughs> right? Now the problem is, I don't know if I'm ready for that monster. Okay, guys, bear with me. I don't think we're going to do this in the next episode. We're going to explore Guiding Lands. We're going to have a few fights in the Ancient Forest area. I want to unlock the Zenoga thing. And, um, yeah, let's, let's just stick to that plan. Probably the episode afterwards, so part, I don't know, 32, I guess. Uh, then we're going to do this. But anyway, a Kirin with a Shattered Horn has been spotted in the Horfrost Reach. Take on the special assignment, Sterling Pride, and investigate. In Iceborne, speak to characters who are purple. Yes, blah, blah, blah. We've heard this all before, guys. Blah, 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 blah. Okay, cool. All right. So, anyway. Guys, we're going to leave it there. Um, this is exciting, man. I can't wait. I really can't wait. This is going to be great. So, I can't wait to face whatever the Admiral's got for us. I actually can't wait to face it. And the reason I'm being so vague... Like I said, I don't want to spoil it so much for uh, new players. But anyway, we'll leave it there. I hope you enjoyed the video otherwise. And I'll see you guys in part 31. And um, we're going to further explore the guiding lands and get it opened up a bit. Thank you very much for joining me today. Thank you very much for watching. And I'll see you in the next part. Take care.